I messed up my local ecosystem by setting hundreds of Californian ladybugs free and never told anyone even after I started noticing the changes. I just recently was reminded of this story by the man on TikTok who let millions of frogs go in his backyard. Someone in the comments mentioned the story of a man who let out ladybugs and a wave of regret hit me when I was about 13. My science teacher let us choose our own final projects. My friend and I wanted to do research on metabolism and after searching around the internet we discovered that ladybugs would be the best test subjects for our experiment. We somehow got approved by our school to order 100 ladybugs from California for the sake of science. However, when they finally arrived it turned out that my teacher had ordered wrong and there were 500 lovely little creatures waiting for us in a box. We got a bigger container to hold them all and ran the experiment as planned. Spring break finally rolled around and my teacher assured us that he would take care of the ladybugs while we were gone. However, when we returned the box sat unmoved on the table. Our teacher had forgotten to feed him and they all lay on the bottom. Dead from starvation. You would think that having done an experiment on the metabolism of these organisms that can withstand crazy temperatures and prolonged starvation we would have realized they could still be alive but no. I cried and felt terrible for leaving all of them to die. My teacher reluctantly gave me permission to go bury them to respect their loss. I opened the container and a swarm of ladybugs took flight. Dissipating into the air. Some were actually dead. But the majority had left the container. My teacher watched this happen and although a lot of the details are fuzzy I'm 99% sure that my teacher told me to keep it quiet. The next years to come came some of the worst ladybug related disasters my small town had ever witnessed. They crusted the windows of every home and ate foliage like crazy. People who were unfortunate enough to have poor insulation, including me, would find them in every nook and cranny in the house. In such a tight-knit community full of farmers and gardeners word spread fast and I just watched it all happen, knowing full well who was responsible. Years went by until the population of ladybugs seemed to go back down. But they still run rampant. I'm not sure what help could have resulted from my confession. But it certainly would have cleared up what had happened for the dozens of townspeople who didn't understand why this was happening to them. I feel absolutely terrible and wish I had confessed sooner. I know it seems like an unfortunate mistake but in hindsight it was reckless and I should have told someone sooner. I have told a few friends since the story re-entered my mind but I just thought I needed to apologize to the public. Edit. The comments have really helped put this whole thing in perspective for me. This story is 100% true from my memory and I am not trying to troll anyone so I'm sorry if it came across that way. I was I'm middle school and hadn't talked about the incident with anyone until very recently so it's possible I assumed some things were a result of my actions that weren't. Thank you all for both the kind words and educating me on what I did wrong. Confessing this and hearing your replies has lifted a weight off my chest.